something every actor should know while playing a spy is um, how to hold a gun. Hi, I'm Maya Erskine. And I'm Donald Glover. And this is how we became Mr. and Mrs. Smith. Do you want us to do a right or? <laughs> no, that's fun. I like that. That was fun. I feel like our gun trainers were really good because they were, you know, they've seen a lot of actors hold guns in shows and they get really peeved by certain tells. Yeah, like that. there was a lot of like, you yeah. know, I think all, everybody always wants to be like that. Uh -huh. He's like, they don't do that. They, yeah. they do that. Yeah, right. Like that, that thing where you like, you know, he's like, why would you do that? Like, it takes too much time. And then you just also not like wincing with one eye. It's like you need both eyes open. That right. Was something right. That I, you just want to go. He's like, like, like why this would you do you that? Think it looks cool. For yeah, you. like a lot of things that you we think of that. Yeah. Um, so like, it's like yeah. And Jack Reacher. I was just trying to be Jack Reacher the entire time. <laughs> the I, entire time. I I, took, I made her call me Jack. <laughs> I liked thinking of Sigourney Weaver from Alien. Just the moments mm. when she was very steely. Uh, and uh, that was a big inspiration. And then Jane Birkin was just kind of the physical inspiration. And Fran was my inspiration mm. sometimes. Oh, I didn't yeah. know that. Yeah, here and there. That makes sense. To believably create chemistry. I mean, it was a lot of, a lot of work. work. A, lot of, a work. lot of work on our own. I had to journal about Donald and do like <laughs> dream analysis. <laughs> dream therapy. <laughs> no, I mean it was very easy. We, I felt like he was, you were one of my friends from. College. No, yeah. Okay. I know you don't think I'm cool enough to be your friend. But... I don't know. I just don't know. <laughs> um, no, I no, I feel the same way. I feel like I've known Maya way longer than we actually yes. know each other. Like it's very strange. But it was it it mirrored. Uh, real life in that like we the the order in which we shot everything was you know the pilot and then the second episode so it is a meet cute so we were really getting to know each other in the beginning and then I feel like our chemistry got even stronger and grew as we filmed because we just got closer and we just knew each other yeah at that point yeah this is your first time in New York should we be asking each other that have you ever killed anyone <laughs> No, no, no. Not really. Really? No. Maya's uh, r really good at... Uh... I'm scared. <laughs> what are you going <laughs> to say? What? What, what, do you think, what do you think I'm going to say? I don't know. Go, say it. <laughs> <laughs> Maya's... Uh, I feel like she's really good at, like, re remembering things as far as... Uh... And Donald's not. Yeah, I'm not. <laughs> I'm not really, like, I'm not good at remembering... Because I've just, I, I am kind of, you, you used a very gentle term, which was like, Donald's very present. Yes. And I was like, yeah, I guess, you know, and I think that allowed me to lay into that, I mean, the character of John Alamo, because he's kind of like that. And he's he's like, yeah, it's all jazz, you know, baby, yeah. we'll, we'll improv it, which I, which I like to do, but you have to plan a lot more. And I feel like she is a planner, and I think she does think about those things and it forced me to be planned. She she, she knew do. what this was before. Like, she'll, she'll be like, oh, we have Rotten Tomatoes at like 12, 15. Like, I'll be like, well, you, thought, you saw to. this. You saw the schedule. I know. Well, then, and then we would talk about this, that Donald, I I think I've told you the story, but our nutritionist when we were training yeah, for yeah. this <laughs> would talk to me and say, like, you know, if I tell Donald to eat a carrot, he'll just say, okay, and he'll eat a carrot. <laughs> and then if I ask you to eat a carrot, Maya, you ask, can I saute it? Can we put <laughs> butter in it? And can I put a little cheese? And she's yeah. like, you negotiate. Whereas Donald, I feel like, is, is and, and your character, which is, did help me, is like, you tell me to jump, I'm gonna jump up. Because he's a soldier. He's a soldier, like, right. So it's like, so, it's like, yeah, this is what I have, and you, you get what you get, and you don't get upset. And I think that just helps open Jane up, and it helps me, uh, it helped me loosen up. So I think it helps you help me get into the character. You act You're like a sitting baby. underneath a shelter I made. Oh, I made this fire, I got you this fish. Shelter, food, fire, water. I was saying this before, I think we improved a lot of the there's a lot of improv improvisation with the um, arguments. I think like yeah. arguments wise, like it's just hard to argue. Th like we script. would have the script and a spine mm. and then go off of it sometimes because we would bring in our own, you know, techniques of arguing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> like I think everybody argues different, 
But it's also just a hard to argue off the script. And we didn't have to. Like, no. like we didn't have to hit it exactly. And we I remember there was one night where we it was a big argument that we kind we kind of re like we got rid we of all got together. Yeah, we all we got together with Fran. And we we're like, okay, we don't need that. We didn't right. this like and I was floored at how well we pulled that off because I was like <laughs> we're tired and like we scary. really shouldn't remember like yeah and then you jump to this and then you do that but because we were allowed to like improv it was and I think we had been in it for so long by that point that we were like yeah yeah okay yeah yeah a goes to B and then C yeah got it yeah, I'll see cool. you <laughs> yeah with very special things with angels <laughs> Be dead. He my we didn't train. We, we trained side by side sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> we did, well, but we didn't yeah. have the same train. Like you would be doing. I I, yeah. I I tend to work out really in the morning, and yeah. you would come a little bit come later. later. But we, we, I mean, we had choreography. Obviously, we had yes. to do it together. We would rehearse that. I like calling it rehearsal. Oh, That's nice. probably not what it is, but yeah, like, it felt like a dance. Oh, yeah. You know, it is a dance. Yeah. Um, Fight for you. yeah. I feel like mine, my character, she, especially in episode eight, it's like, it's dirty. Like it's like like a cat. Like I feel like that's <laughs> Jane, very vicious and can let her emotions. When she's incredibly angry, that takes over her fighting style. Mm -hmm. And yeah. I feel like you might be more measured, but I don't really know. Yeah, I feel like, yeah, it's like, you know, I, I tried to fight. I tried to make it, like, technically good, but mm -hmm. also um, kind of, like, I, I, li I like it when it looks like a struggle. Like, I feel like, especially, like, in the last couple of episodes, like, we would fight, and then, mm -hmm. but I was like, I want to show how quickly you get tired. Like, I think people it's, forget yes. how quickly you like you have a bunch of energies for those first mm -hmm. things but after a few things like you both like you watch boxing it's like yeah they're oh people are like why are they laying on each other it's like well <laughs> it's very hard yes you know <laughs> it's, they, what they're doing is it's so very true. hard so I, I tried to like work that in so it's like yeah. measured but then by the like in a couple minutes you're like I'm trying really hard to you know, keep, keep mm -hmm. it together. I feel like in this show a lot of the missions and I think it's designed this way are to to provoke or or uh, sort of poke holes at our own insecurities so something that you know John might be doing in a mission which could be like calling someone it might unleash this insecurity that Jane has that why are you on your phone so much who are you talking to um, which is what Donald and Fran like to call the spy sandwich when the mm -hmm. with the spy trope can be married into the relationship. Mm -hmm. um, no, yeah, I think like Fran was. She, she always had a really good, uh, a, a really good hold on like the idea of each episode is a relationship. Mm -hmm. Goal like a, the boundary, like a kind of like a tent pole of a, the relationship, and they're right. like kind of named that way too. So she was really good about like, yeah, it's influencing us as a spy, but it's really also a relationship, like, uh, you know, buoy. And I think like that really always like, for me, that was like kind of a, a north star in mm -hmm. each episode where it's like, what am I learning in this episode? As right. far as like, it's like, okay, like, yeah, we have to share space in this episode. Mm -hmm. We're on our vacation. This is the first time we're ever really been in a room, mm -hmm. like. So this is what I'm I'm learning this as a, like a relationship, but also as a spy. I mean, they all really do help further, I think, John yeah. and Jane's character development, but I feel like Parker Posey and Parker Walker. Posey and Wagner, but also like Michaela. Michaela, for I sure. I feel like Michaela's like character was a turning point for It was a turning point for, for our for relationship, us. but so were the that couple. Scene you guys is great. So I haven't seen it. She's amazing. But it mm, was... really good. Um, yeah, I guess she was a turning point for our characters in that um, it was the first time you get to see, I think it's the first time you get to see Jane really reveal her deep feelings for John and her fears about him and where they stand in a, in a couple and the first sign of breaking um, or going outside of your relationship, what that means. Um, and establishing trust. And then mm. I, I think with, with Parker and Wagner, it was like the first time you see uh, John and Jane really um, 
be aligned together in a way that I feel like a lot of couples can relate to and I feel like it was written so well but of, of us making fun of the other couple <laughs> at the end of a, a dinner party. It's just a job. It is not life and death. <laughs> <laughs> you feel better? We had done that. It's funny, like that episode got done last. last. One of the that last was... episodes. So we had done a bunch of stuff already. Mm -hmm. And it was a it was interesting rehashing that that stuff. Well, I didn't I, I felt like it it was starting to feel like the therapist was favoring John and that was making me really uncomfortable. And I, I, it, it brought out all these feelings that I felt like Jane was going through of feeling like, this isn't fair, she just <laughs> likes you more. Um, and was missing the point of the therapy, but. It was a fun. But yeah. The fun setup, cause it's like, yeah, it just feels real. Like I feel like that's what's cool about it. It's like, it's just a, re you, it's, 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 it's like the, the further, the farther you run away from yourself, there you are. Like you can't mm -hmm. get escape away, it. Escape, escape it. It's like, we should, we're going here to get help. And it's like, but the same problems. Yeah. Kind of there, so. mm -hmm. It was great.